Hey, 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 hey. Shuckalack. Get me all chat window up there. How's everyone doing? Just getting all my chats and stuff done. Yeah, Tom, thank you so much for the like. How are you doing? Right, this over here. Oh, let's pause that. Loving it. And Dale coming in with a like as well. Good to see you, man. Get all my other chats out. <laughs> One chat. Lovely, lovely. Hey, oh, Tom, thank you so much for the likes. Really appreciate it. We are currently at Popham. The old seatbelt. We're currently at Popham. And uh, we're going to be taking the Cessna 172 down to um, Goodwood. So we've got the Cessna. We've got the, the Fly Goodwood livery as well that the, uh, the uh, Cessnas have down. There we're going to be going there. This is, like I say, burning blue designs. I'll pop them. Absolutely awesome. Little airfield. And I'm sure over here. Is it this one? There's someone flying a remote control airplane over here somewhere. I'm sure it's this one. Yep, here they are. <laughs> there you go. Got their RC plane out there. We've got the smoke from the CAF. As the time changes, the CAF opens and shuts. As well as the uh, sign somewhere says open and shut. I don't remember where that is. Oh yeah, airfield open. That opens and shuts depending on the time. It's really well detailed. I absolutely love their airfields. Really, really do. They go the extra mile. We're going to take 172 Cessna. To the new burning blue design Goodwood. Like I say, we've got the Goodwood livery going. Uh, Gavin, thank you so much for the like. Appreciate it. There with a big bone coming there. Right, let's jump inside. He says. Get inside. Uh, sort my sounds out. They're really, really low. There we go. I don't know why it's so quiet. You know what? I've never ever flown the Cessna. AB, thank you for the like. Cessna's usually like the first thing you get in. I don't think I've ever flown this, you know. How's the food truck going? I haven't been on it for a couple of days, AB. They've done an update, but um, I need to check it out again. Uh, I've just been on so many other things. Farm sim, trucking, uh, obviously flight sim. There's all sorts of stuff. Uh, how are you? I'm very well, Gavin. Thank you. I hope you are geared. Dara, thank you so much for the like. We're going to go right down to the end of the runway here. We're going to take off away from the petrol station. It's a proper unique approach to this. You have to approach the field from this area here. Uh, actually, sorry, it's just this over this hedge here. There's like a... See if we can see it quickly while we're trundling down here. Put the brakes on. Go out here. There's an arrow. Arrow here, look. When you're flying into this airport, you have no flight permission. BMX track here. You have no permission to go anywhere near the um, petrol station, obviously, because you know to prevent accidents. But when you're actually on the approach, you have to come in from this uh, this arrow line here, and then towards the runway here, and then last minute you have to turn, and go down, and land. Pretty crazy. Oh, 
going to be Dennis in the comp. Ooh. Ah, is that how far you are now? I think I've got permission to go to the to the comp. I think I need, need to raise the money for the entry, I think. Alright, let's get around here. Let's line up here. Right, let's get ready to go. Ciao, thank you so much for the like. Faye coming in with the heart reaction there. Appreciate it. Just need to sort out my um, Elgatos here. They're all in the wrong place. Why are they all in the wrong place? That's not good, is it? That's on that mouse wire. That's no good. What is going on here? Certainly not breakfast. <laughs> Right, here we go, let's get some sound here. It's very quiet, this one. Uh, yeah, the little one uh, been taken to hospital, had a seizure. What a day it's been. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that, Gavin. Uh, have a good flight, hope all is well. Cheers, Vicky, thank you very much. Uh, like I say, we're in the Cessna 172 in the Goodwood livery. We're about to take off. We are about to take off and uh, go to the new Burning Blue Design Goodwood. It's super duper quiet, this aircraft. Uh, Vicky, thank you so much for the like and the share. Appreciate it. This will be my first time ever in a Cessna on this sim, I believe. To the right a little bit. Up the hill we go. This is one of the Goodwood Cessnas. We're not that far from Goodwood at all, so that should be a pretty good flight over there. I uh, hope it's okay, Gavin. Yeah, I hope so, Gavin. I hope he recovers well. Uh, Gary's saying, what server and can I fly my F-35? You can indeed. Uh, it'd be East USA, Gary. They should at least give you the option to keep the passenger or not, shouldn't they, on the internal view? Because it's there, so you know. Probably a mod for it. I have to dig one out. So yeah, quite a few little surprises when we get to um, Goodwood. Some uh, stuff they weren't sure if they were going to be doing or not, but they did, they have done. They kind of when they, when we're doing beta testing and uh, some of the design work up to it, kind of you know, oh we don't know because it's quite difficult to implement and that kind of thing, and they've done it. So. It's good. It certainly creates a whole new sense of um, realism to the airfield. You know, kind of brings it alive a little bit, which is cool. Uh, Nick, evening, mate. How you doing, Nick? Hope you're well. Thanks for the like. Loading Goodwood now. Nice. Uh, cheers both. Yeah, she's doing a lot better now. It's hard as a parent to stand there and talk to them and they have no idea who you are, but that seems to have come back now. Oh, glad glad the, she's feeling better, Gavin. Thank you to like, for the like, Nick. Really appreciate that. Uh, yeah, AB, uh, which version are you getting? If it's 1.01... Uh, it's not the optimized version that they've they've just released a, a new optimized version, which uh, really has been optimized without losing the detail. You gain about an extra ten FPS or so, if at least. Pretty good. I need to bloody hurry up with this update ten. Taking the P now. I know. I'm waiting for it. I want to be able to switch name tags on and off, so I know who I'm flying with. They can't just sneak up on me. 
Liam coming in with a like. Mark shit thought he's out. <laughs> it's actually running nice tonight. Running nice. Look, nice and smooth. Whee, is how it should be. All 60 frames, no stutters. There's a f there'll be a few little blips as we get towards Goodwood, but it's just because of the immense amount of um, uh, the immense amount of detail they put in, and it's a. Uh, it will be optimized for update 10 as well so once update 10 drops it'll be uh, so much better i don't notice it too much on my system but some people have said so we shall see we shall see i only did a quick little flyover so east usa gary hey ab i'm good thanks to you are we hanging in good to hear good to hear So what I'll do is we're almost there so what I'll do is I'll do a few little uh, loops circuits around the airfield and then we're going to land we have a little look around I'm looking forward to actually having a proper look around we've got to try and find Mr Doberman it's a it's a guy that's in the burning blue design discord he does a lot of work for a for a Doberman charity and they actually modeled him quite a few airports ago they modeled him into the airports and it's it's almost become a game of find Mr. Doberman in the airports. He's usually lurking around somewhere. Bloody load shedding is killing us here in South Africa. Power off more than we are on a stage six. Load shedding? What's load shedding? Is that like where they're stopping people using electricity or something? All good to chill with my wife, watching TV in bed. Nice. It's, it's weird. Um, you know, they're, they're telling everyone to go electric, and then the grid can't handle it. They cut power off nationally. That's insane. I uh, want to get my custom F-15 back in the air, damn it. I've got Sydney Gaming to be sneaking up on. Custom F-15? What's that one then, Nick? Uh, Nick? Are you not on the beta, do you mean? I, was, I, was, I forgot I was going to be I thought I was going to be day streaming tomorrow but I've got my eye test tomorrow so see how blind I am which uh, I, I have noticed my eyesight deteriorate I've got a feeling it's to doing like 16 hours a day on the PC you know Whee. now I'm going to wait for release rumoured to be Thursday yeah see, it was rumoured to be last Thursday I think oh no this Thursday isn't it yeah yeah sorry I thought it was going to be a bit earlier, to be fair. They're kind of blaming NVIDIA. But it's like, you can't really blame NVIDIA if you're optimizing the sim based on NVIDIA's update. But NVIDIA isn't ready to release the update. So how can you optimize it for an update that's not ready to be released? Because they're still working on an update. Yeah. So yeah, we'll see, we'll see. This is something that not quite make sense there. Uh, I think they'll hold it off until the 27th of September and release it alongside World Update 11. Um, I don't think they're at risk doing two at once because they won't know what's broken whether it's one update or the other. So I think they will... I think they'll drop it like a week apart at least, or two weeks maybe. They'll postpone update 11, you watch. Okay with you, Vulcan. Thanks for the like, man. I was just saying... J JJ was just saying that he wants to go to Goodwood, and so do I. Every year that I've brought a ticket, I've been let down. Like, I've actually brought tickets to Goodwood, and then my lift... A night or two before has been like, oh, I can't go now. Why is that? Oh, well, I made other plans. 
I'll be like, okay, fair enough. So then I've either had to sell my ticket or just lose the money. But obviously now I've got my bike coming and I'm going to get my stuff sorted out. I'll be able to go next year. Hell yeah. And I, uh, JJ said he's always wanted to go, so, you know, if there's a spare seat on the bike, if you know if Faye can't get the day off or she doesn't want to go and there's a spare seat, then I'll pick you up, man. I shall pick you up. Uh, seeing that, did you see the over Vulcan overshoot the runway? I did indeed. That day, right, I saw it pretty much as it was happening, like as it happened, not long after. And then since then, like, every half an hour, an hour, I get a message or an inbox or a photo of it. <laughs> there any thanks for the like? Like, have you seen this? Have you seen this? Have you seen this? Do you see the Vulcan? See the Vulcan? Vulcan overshot the runway. Do you see this? What do you think of this? Like almost every half hour an hour. Getting some proper wind shear here. But yeah, I'm just hoping they don't use it as an excuse to uh, stop doing runs with the taxi. Yeah, with the you know taxi runs with the um, with the Vulcan. I really hope they don't use it as. A it's kind of like a perfect excuse for them to say it's not safe anymore. And they'll put it down to the aging brakes and checks and no one qualified to check it and all this. It's just... Yeah, sorry, AB, that kind of external links to stuff. Facebook proper drill your ass over external links from Facebook. Sorry, man. I bet there's a lot of boat race getting their car validated for stains in the seat. I'd have loved it. I'd have been like, come on, hit me. And then I'd have nicked the wheel and gone. That's a real Vulcan undercarriage in the, in the car. I'd have probably left the damage as well, so everyone's like, oh, have you been in a car accident? I'd be like, no, actually, a Vulcan hit my car. <laughs> An Avro Vulcan at that. <laughs> I would probably, oh, that's probably what I'd do, you know. I'd, I'd be down the garage like, can you put some uh, some lacquer over this so it don't rust? They'd be like, what, do you want us to repair it? No, I want you to rust protect it. <laughs> Vulcan hit my car. Alright, here we go. Goodwood's coming up on our slightly left hand side. Shell, thanks for the like. Uh, you'll be like, here, yeah, look at the video. I've still got the shit stain on my driver's seat. Come, come, look. <laughs> A bit nutty. Yo, yo, Brian Gray, how you doing? That's the G. Thanks for like. Dave, thanks for like. Brian, thanks for like. All right, we are coming up on Goodwood now. I can see it in the distance. They've also modelled Goodwood House as well. There's a few people doing races around the track in planes as well, like with the Spitfire and stuff. I really need to... I'm looking forward to World Update 10 when I can put my LOD back to what it used to be before Update 9. 
Oh, here comes one of the cars. Meow. Yeah, I used to have a really high lot on this until like updates eight or nine when it killed it. There's another one. Everything loading and caching. Right, what runway are we going to land at? 24? Or should we go for... Yeah, if I land in coming, uh, coming back ourselves, we get really close to the hangar then, don't we? Actually, I'll come in over this side. we we'll circle around. I'm going to land at this one and we're going to roll over to the hangar and have a little look, quick look around. What's good, Nick? What's good, Brian? Thank you so much for the uh, double like there, man. Oh, boss man's here. The Shackleton. About to land at Heathrow, coming from LAX. Ah, oh, nice, Dave. Looks like I'm going really quick when you're doing like 80. I'm hoping it'll slow down. It's still doing 40, yeah? 30, 20. Oh, look at that. Just made it to the end of the runway. That's mad. Oh, we've got a car and a skid pan. Get that aircraft over here. Nice landings there. Let's get in the drone cam. If I can. Yeah. Oh, 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 let's have a little nose around, shall we? And check out this car over here doing a little. Making its way around the skid pan. All the cones only. My LOD's quite low at the minute. So I had a problem with update 9, so I reduced my LODs. I wanted to keep it at 60 frames, so I've kind of sacrificed some uh some LOD distance in order to retain 60 frames as best as possible. Which I'm hoping with update 10 I can put back. It used to be on like nearly 200, uh, so like double what it is now. Back to kind of the 100, 110. Oh, there's some rubbish down there. There's cars in there. Who have we got hiding in here? Need to try and find Mr. Doberman. Not around here. Oh, the bus in it. Uh, they always do such cool work. 
apparently, apparently, the next update of this airport is, I think, is going to include a double-seated, uh, double-seated Spitfire, which is uh, more accurate to what they have here at the moment. Hey, here he is, Mr. Doberman. There he is. I got here. Good shops. Get ourselves onto the track in a minute. Hangers. We could finally learn the Phoenix is going to take it out for a spin a little bit. Nice. Good to see you got it working, man. stands at the back all the stands down the front should see some cars going past in a second uh, Scotty thanks for like Sydney Gaming thanks for like how you doing that'd be good we're just down at Goodwood right now here I can see a car coming I can see a race car coming another one. Only took Shane and Tony three times to teach me till I got took notes. <laughs> yeah, yet yeah, again they've done a really good job. Gone like crazy crazy with the details again. another one that's awesome they got the cars racing around as well now for the house I think it's over there uh, based off the new Vanguish I think the race car definitely looks like it uh, they've included the house as well a good one Everyone was saying about it, so they've stuck this in as well for now. The famous house, because obviously they have all like you can kind of see where the marks are in the ground where they have all the uh, tents and all this stuff and the events things going on. They have the drag up the hill, goes around there and up here. Pretty cool. You can even still see the cars at this height going around, which is really cool. Kieran, thanks for the like. You can just about see one going over the start finish line, just around the hairpin. There's another one coming down on the right hand side. There's one right over the far end. They actually look like they're set to different speeds as well, because uh, they were really close together, those first two. And now they're really far apart. So it looks like they're slightly set at different paces, which means, of course, at some points they'll be close to like, overtaking and stuff, which would be cool. Look like they're proper racing then. I'm really impressed. Really, really impressed. Again, this is another one by Burn Blue Design. I think, don't quote me on this, I think it's about 12 or 15 pounds, something like that. And it'll be on the marketplace, so you'll be able to get it on Xbox. They're starting to do everything for Xbox now. I think you can get it on the Orbix uh, site as well. I just think it's so cool. You got like just the extra cars and stuff like that. It's so cool. Let's do a proper little fly around video. Yeah. It's awesome. Right, I'm coming back here. I'm going to switch aircraft. I am coming back here. I'm going to quickly switch aircraft. So bear with for a second. I'm going to switch aircraft. 
I just need to change. Welcome, welcome. Down here we are. Goodwood. What aircraft are we going in? Yeah. Not going in the Cessna anymore. We're going to sound a little bit more poke, shall we? Um let's go for a little nice little cruise. What should we take out, ladies and gentlemen? Might take the Vulcan out a little bit later, but not right now. What did I have out earlier? Can't remember. Shit. Yeah. Um, that was right. The uh, let's see if I can find it. Find it, find it, find it, find it, find it. Seems we got some. Have we got? Uh, we haven't got jets with us, have we? I want to try and do some mid area fueling at some point. I know it's obviously not real, but like kind of simulated. Uh, was it an F3 that I had? It listed as a. I think it's this one. We're going to see if we can take off from here. I don't know if we will, but we're going to try for a laugh. Go. I'm going to take the tornado out for a spin. How's everyone been doing? Hope you've been, all been doing good. It was, uh, yeah, sorry about last night having a night off. I was just absolutely like cream crackered yesterday. I don't know what came over me. I've had I've had loads of sleep and I still feel like crap, to be honest. I think we've caught Cade's plague. Really groggy. So I don't know if this is going to take off from here. Even the co-pilot's like just suck, knock his head in shame that like they're broken. Broken neck. We're going to get maximum run up here. We should be good. So we're taking off from Goodwood. The tornado. It's, it's fun to fly. It needs work, but it's fun to fly. Uh, Danny, thanks for the like. We still can't still be pushing back, are we? I think we were. <laughs> Alright, so get everyone get in and get ready. Co pilot got head buried in that sick bucket. You haven't even taken off yet. I know, he's proper broken his neck. Look, peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I've never got in or fixed it. I should do really, shouldn't I? Yes, I'm behind me. Ooh. So we're going to take a right hand out of here. I'm going to go down the coastline. I'm going to do a touch and go at Lid. And on our journey to Lid, I want some southern airports uh, put in the chat where you'd like to... Um, I would like to see us land or take off or do a um, touch and go. We'll try and go slow, uh, AB, but I've got a feeling the Shackleton's going to struggle. 
I think we can stick it to 200, 250. You've got Scotty with us in the Eurofire. Look at all this. <laughs> That's definitely a green shot moment there. This would be an interesting view at Goodwood, wouldn't it? Right, so yeah, we'll, we'll keep it about 250. We'll keep it about 250. We're going to head along the coastline to Lyd. And as I say, as we're flying there, anywhere in the southeast of England or somewhere like that, the east of England, right, uh, jot some airfields down and we'll see what we can do. Let's go. See you, boys. I'm not going to fold the wings back because I'm already at 330. Slow down, 280. Head back out towards the coast. How cool does that look? The uh, pilot's head in the front moves according to the direction. I'm wanting to go up, down, up, down. You just want to see his head tilt in there. The other one's like dead. There you go, you can see his head. I'll have to get in there and sort his head out now. Right, let's get up to two fifty. where AB is and he's able to keep up. Right, so I need to put it on to accelerate a little bit and it's gone 380. Pretty quick. Two of the F fifteen, hell yeah. We've got Gavin, got E, got A B, who else we got in here? Are you in Gary? Got some boats below. Okay, at this speed, AV is that AV there? He's still looking. I think it is. It's going nuts. So, like I say, following the coastline down towards Lids, so we're going over Shore and by Sea and Brighton. We're going to go over Brighton. It's another place I want to go to. I can't wait. And next year is just going to be crazy because I've got so many places I want to go. Just to say, I've been there, like. 
since playing this sim two years it started like it is pretty much the anniversary two years this this month or so and um i'm sure it was september it was released but yeah two years or so um and flying around the uk it's really highlighted just how little i've seen of my own country and that's really quite sad to say really when you think about it it's always been local like within sort of quick trains and going out with mates and stuff you know but you know south end plankton it's kind of like the southeast of england i've kind of done like east anglia it's more so um you know chelmsford colchester braintree and just kind of stuck local really only venturing out for like events and things you know to london or air shows when we were a kid again mildon hall Oxford, which is still South East England, really. So now I've got all these places I want to go, and I'm going to be able to after Christmas. It's going to be amazing. Danny, thank you so much for the link. got live weather on which keeps changing it says Brighton Pig oh excuse me wow it caught up on me we had I've done spaghetti bolognese for dinner and I've, I've had hiccups and all sorts of stuff this evening excuse me it caught me out caught me off guard bloody hiccup oh I'm not going to get the hiccups again it took forever for them to go earlier Go past Seaford and Eastbourne, up past Hastings, and then we'll be at Lid for a nice little touch and go. Uh, let me know if this is too fast, AB. We're doing like 360. Meow. Doesn't seem to be. since I've been flying up the coast here, it's nice. So we're out in the tornado. We've got AB in the Shackleton. Scotty in the, was in the Eurofighter. Gavin in the F-15. Who else have we got with us? Some screenshots as well. On uh, Bex Hill on Sea, and then Hastings, and then we're right by Lid. That's saying the chat. Let me know what airport you want to go to, or want to see, or anywhere you want. Like somewhere you like South End, maybe you want to see. We'll head over to South End. Go and see the Vulcan at South End Airport. Ooh, what are them square marinas down there? Thanks for like.
also the interior out here. Oh. No one in there at all. Ooh, tornado, nipping real quick one to see one of my favourite aircraft. Awesome, Craig. Cheers, man. Hope you're good. Love the sound of the pod. <laughs> it is little touches like that, though, sometimes in an aircraft. They're missing a lot of that on, on, on the native aircraft. I think some of the little quirks and sounds and things. Right, we're coming up on lid. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna slow down and try and do a uh, do a a touch and go as soon as we're there without having to do a circuit or anything like that. Uh, there's an aqueduct by where I live that's got that's all lit up at night on the sim. Actually happened. I was surprised it was on the sim. Ah, that's good to hear. Let's see where we are in relation to the airfield. Let's try and gauge it from here. Right, back to work. See you later. Cheers, Craig. Take care, man. Thank you so much for the like as well. Appreciate it. Slow it down. Going for a touch and go, and then head on towards South End, I think. Been a little while since I've landed at South End. Flaps in action. Runway to our left. Cruise in at like one about 120. It's holding its own here. Nice. Play with the like share follow. Thank you, thank you. All. We're gonna have a tornado landing or doing a touch and go at uh, Lid, which is technically known as London Ashford Airport in Lid. <laughs> Dave, client has got to talk to me, Goose. Yeah. Goose, play with the followage. A little bit of a crosswind here. A bit high. A bit steep. We're just doing a touch and go right here, so nothing too crazy. Ooh. 
bene Oh, there's someone a lift. Why not? That's a bit, that's a bit mad. He didn't want a lift. Ah, uh, but it initiated the taxi options, didn't it? Rather, yeah. <laughs> Should have realised that. Sometimes it goes into like taxi mode, and you have to kind of get to a certain speed to break it out. It assumes you're landing, so it's, it takes over the aircraft a bit with taxi kind of bit ways. I used to get there in the Vulcan until I edited it. Up to speed, right? Should be going too fast, actually. Slow down for everyone. But yeah, some aircraft, import aircraft, that is, uh, when you land, it assumes obviously you're landing. As soon as the wheels touch the ground, it goes into um, some sort of like taxi mode. And you have to get above a certain speed before it's like, oh, okay, I'm taking off again. A bit weird, but there's some things you have to edit to take that off. Yeah, that's why I wouldn't take off straight away. It was like, uh, I don't know, I don't know, maybe. We were doing 160 at the time. It should have been uh, more than e easily taken off. Uh, Favour the followage, 932. Indeed, nice. Just a crazy front view there, isn't it? Right, we've got the White Cliffs of Dover coming up. White Cliffs of Dover. Still can't get over the followage fade. 932 days, that's crazy. Cliffs of Dover. Crazy. Wish I'd sort this loading out a lot sooner. Coastline should be loaded in a lot earlier than they are. We're going to head over Ramsgate. Close to where my friends live. Big shout out to Natty. Although I think we've already gone over where they are. Oh no, could you got right there at Ramsgate? towards a Ramsgate. There's an airport right actually there, close to where they are. Uh, Monston. 
Oh, sorry, Manston. Is it Manston? Yeah, Manston Airport. Oh, that was an A. Manston Road, Manston Airport. Yeah, there we go. Let's see that. Maybe down a bit. Oh, here they come. So I'm just going to head out so see if I can catch some screenshots of these and we'll send it to them. Do you recognise any of these places? This is Broadstairs, heading up towards Kingsgate. We've got Margate around the corner. I always remember Margate, it's where my auntie lived and we went there for the fall. We went and met up with her and there was a theme park. I always remember that. That was like the first time I'd ever gone to Kentway. And then I did an event at Ashford. And then uh, we went to Kent for my friend Natty's wedding reception. That's like three times I've been to Kent. I think it was something like Dreamland or something like that. Marcos, thanks for like. We've got Westgate on C. See, so yeah, I'm going to spam the, the WhatsApp with some uh, images later on, see if they recognise where I was. So you've got Westgate on sea right here, and then you've got a uh, Minis Bay. Pedal to the middle for a little bit and see what we can get up to. What are we at now? 450. 5.50. 6.50. 6.50. Seven hundred. Seven hundred. Oh, we're at nine hundred. We're at Mac one. Oh. If I do a turn, it goes like mental. One point three, one point four. 
Wait, that's a lot of that. Ah, slow it down. Let's slow it down, something like that then. <laughs> it's like the quickest I've ever got to the south end. We're still doing 1.4. Hey, Valin, thank you for the like. They say very nice plane is indeed. We're just glitching it out, see how fast it would go there. I really didn't like that then. That was one way to get there quick, wouldn't it? <laughs> I hit 1.7, Mac 1.7 then. That's pretty mad. It shouldn't do, obviously glitched it out, but yeah. Right, so this is South End, heading up South End High Street, right towards South End train station. This is the Royal Mail facility down there, you can see all the red vans. Head out towards the L port. Which is just to our left. Got the Vulcan down the bottom left here. Uh, excuse me, bus. Found a landing. Not bad landing, considering. Bad at all. Right next to Ryanair. Those bombs are so big, the plane looks like it's carrying luggage. Yeah, uh, true. Uh, Daniel, thank you so much for the like. 
Everybody in you playing building sim tomorrow? Uh, I may well be, yes, I may well be. All depends on what time it's released, uh, when the keys are released and that kind of thing, so... As to whether I can get on and get past certain things and stuff, because apparently you have to get on and do a tutorial before you can do too much, so... Yeah, we'll be, I'll be sorting it all out and... Yeah, all being well, Daniel, we'll be on with some other people as well. So we're trying to have a bit of multiplayer madness. I'm actually considering having a little looky-looky. What the VATS sim situation is like. Have a little look. Hmm. Seems to be a whole UK controller. Currently at South End. Player, that's good to be honest. I may download it on laptop and take it to work. Nice, that will be good. actually know what uh See other deliveries I've got on there. Canadian, this one or something, isn't it? Need to find the airport uh, airplane code for this. Uh, Here, shall we? Yeah, we go. Uh, the F1 Mirage, not in there, I don't think so. Uh, oh, wait, Steam is 8 BST, yeah, but it all I've got it through CD keys, so it. It, it will be when Steam decide to release the key. Sometimes they do it on time or early, and sometimes they can be a bit arsehole and like leave it an hour or something like that, or more maybe. So it all depends when I get the keys dropped. But it was like ten pound saving, so I'm not going to quibble at ten pound. So hopefully I get it through the day. I'm out until one or two, I think. So I'm going to get my eyes tested, get some, get my goggles sorted out. Um, and then, yeah, when, when I get back, I'll load it up, get it installed, and then see what the deal is. I think you have to do the tutorials and stuff before you can do multiplayer, so I might jump through those just to get going, and then stream multiplayer in the evening. Uh, yeah, CD keys are due to get the keys around the same time, according to dev, so that'd be good then, so I can get it done before I go out, get it installed at least before I go out, and then when I come back, get through the tutorials. Uh, we've got one up here, that's not me, that's me there. We've got one out. Who else is there? No flight plan.
Și... We're MC, aren't we? AGMC. And we're going to UTC. Time on here would be 9.42, so we're going at 9, I don't say 50. Need to get on, yeah, I do. There is a London South controller. So it might be worth heading on to them. Uh, one, two, nine. Uh, four, two, five. Hello, one, two, Tango, contact Heathrow, 119 decimal 725. 119 and 75, thanks, goodbye. Shuttle, one, two, Tango. All right, who we got with us? Ooh, we've got a couple of people coming in. Woo hoo! Flight plan is a failed. Have a long day tomorrow, so bring on 8 p.m. when I'm doing security shift. I should be playing it. Ah, oh, nice, awesome. Go factory, empty taxi. Any stands tonight? Go factory, empty taxi to any stand. Thanks for the HC and thanks for the help. Appreciate. It. Five one zero five two six left. Service wing calm. Please take off. It's me and the tiger. Nice, 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 nice. I'm one, gonna four, quick. Six, nothing further. Monitina calm. One two two. Decimal eight. Good night. You may calm. Four speed to run for six. Thanks for the users. Bye bye. I'm gonna quickly. Bravo hello. Easy four Alpha Charlie level six five. Timing level seven zero. Compton for Bravo. Easy four Alpha Charlie London. Time flight level one four zero. I'm gonna quickly go and grab a bottle of drink, and I shall be. All in control, get in the spares. Left 345, Ryanair 23 in the middle. Front of the control, Yarik Pettit, Expo 529, Saddle 36, Sherry inbound, Bassox. Score 529, London, Roger, score 0331. 0331 for Expo 29. Hello there. Hello. Grab that right, we're back in a second. November 930, Delta Whiskey, pass your message. I did November 930, Delta Whiskey, big in the hill, I have my plan to break. Minor 2 3 Lima Hotel, turn left, heading 285, cleared ILS, runway 26 left. Left 285 and uh, cleared ILS, 26 left to the right, 2 3 Lima Hotel. Drink once I'm flying. Easy, 5105 passing through that. Right, so we don't have any ATIS or anything here right now. Uh, what current stand am I on? I don't even know what stand I'm on. Stand 7. Easy 5105, 4000 feet. Easy 5105, climb now, flight level 130. Climb me now, 130, easy 5103. Arrow 5105, question. November 930, Delta Whiskey, clear it when you ready. Go ahead, November Delta Number 930, Delta Whiskey clearances via the Dover 2 departure, standard route after departure, right turn out via the Biggin overhead, on track to Detling, climbing to altitude 2,400 feet, squawk 1071. London Control, you can go over 7070, good evening. Right, thank you, the overhead being seat lean. 
maintain 2,400, on the squawk, November 19, November 19. November 930, Delta Whiskey, correct. Station checking in, second. Oh, apologies, you stopped on someone that was uh, quiet. Uh, you reach your 773 good evening. You reach your 77, I'm done, Roger. Expo 529, thank you. Airbus 1, Mike, arrival, Manchester. Airbus 1, Mike, Expo 529. Expo 275, Victor, when you're ready, D75 level 380. We're ready, D75 level 380, Expo 5, direction 275, Victor. X-ray hotel 558 currently at stand 7 at uh, South End. Would I be under your control at all? X-ray hotel 558 FM. Uh, got a flight, uh, X-ray hotel 558 got a flight plan filed for Manchester. Currently, at, like I say, stand 7 uh, South End in a tornado. Looking for clearance to a no uh, VFR north exit. Thank you. Exit hotel 558, right to clearance will be at the hold. Start is approved. Start approved, clearance hold. Thank you, exit hotel 558. Ryanair 23, Ryanair 2. Ryanair 23, Lima Hotel, are you happy to continue visually? Uh, yeah, we're, we're already going on the visual. Ryanair 23, Lima Hotel. Ryanair 23, Lima Hotel, clear visual approach, runway 26 left, number 1. Visual approach, uh, 26 left, number 1, Ryanair 23, Lima Hotel. Land control, good evening. Air Force 1327 on Company 4 Bravo, departure out of Luton, uh, flight level 70. Air France 1337, London, Roger, climb flight level 140. Climb flight level 140, uh, Air Force 1327. 84 Alpha Charlie, climb flight level 290. Climbing 290, 84 Alpha Charlie. I don't actually know what runway is in use, so. I'm just going to do a 180. 85105, climb flight level 220. Climb flight level 220, 85105. Air France 1337, route direct Goodwood. Direct Goodwood, Air France 137. Ryanair 13, Papa Hotel, turn left, heading 105, expect a right downwind for runway 26 left. Apologies, zero is for repeat instructions. Ryanair 13, Papa Hotel, turn left, heading 105, expect a right hand downwind from way 26 left. What's it, 105, expect a right hand downwind, uh, Ryanair 13, Papa Hotel. Expo 275, Victor, contact London, 127, decimal 1, good night. 1271, Expo 275, Victor, see ya. Expo Hotel, 58, ready for taxi instruction, thank you. Hotel 558, taxi holding point Alpha 1, runway 23, QNH 1024. Uh, holding point Alpha 1 via uh, runway 23, QNH 1024, thank you, it's Hotel 558. Ryanair 13, Papa Hotel, descend flight level 8. Descend 8 0, 13 Papa Hotel. November 9 and 3, Joe Dada with the signature, we're close to Hackney, we're now. Two stations there, try again. November 9th, Joe Dada will see his signature, big and hell request tax. It's all the interior November hours. <laughs> and the contact point of the world. Delta Delta Whiskey, tax point alpha the one, contact point's really one, low, isn't it? It's like H half the world, really. And the animation's reversed as well. Oh. Alpha one, oh it is as well. <laughs> the animation's one, gone one, reverse one, for some one, reason. One, what? One, uh, it's never been like that before. It's like break dancing. <laughs> <laughs> what on earth? Uh, this plane's See, now in a very good day. Contact uh, points uh, need uh, raising. Uh, animations uh, reverse uh, at the front uh, for some reason. I've never seen it do that before. It's a new one. Uh, Delta Whiskey, 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 uh, uh, actually, could you turn that again, please? Uh, 85105, 85105, 85105, 85105, 
Mark that one should be at uh, AC 5105. <laughs> Sorry about the nothing, but I'm going to start up with the request from my 03, but not for fun. November 930, Delta Whiskey, Roger, runway 03 for departure, taxi holding point Foxtrot 1. Foxtrot 1, runway 03, November 930, Delta Whiskey. Alright, that's you freely, my hotel, Foxtrot Roman. Alright, that's you freely, my hotel, Roger, if you continue via 08 left, Romeo and Juliet, Park Stand 15. Stand one five, continue to right left for me and uh, Julia. And I ran out to freedom hotel. Stand two three, Lima hotel, correction to the stand, stand one six, please. Stand one six, run out to freedom hotel. London Centre, Golf Bravo, Juliet, India Echo. Come up. East Air France one three three seven, climb flight level two three zero. Climb flight level two three zero, up on one two. Expo 529, contact London 127 decimal 1. Good night. London 127 decimal 1, Expo 529, cheers, Pat. Speedbed 843, descend flight level 150, level Tiger. Level Tiger? Wow. Easy Tiger. Bit pour a drink before I get my clearance. Alright, say again for Speedbird, Speedbed 843, descend flight level 150, level Tiger. Then you can find a one five zero eleven tiger. currently holding Alpha One South End, thank you. Extra hotel five five eight Roger departure instructions when you're ready. Uh yep, uh ready, thank you, XRT five five eight. Exit Hotel 558, hold position after departure of runway 23, right turn out, clear to leave control of airspace to the north, not of altitude, 2000 feet VFR, score 4307. Uh, runway 23, uh, after departure, right hand turn, uh, exit via north, uh, not above 2000 feet VFR, squawk 4307, Exit Hotel 558. Exit Hotel 558, correct report, ready for departure. Right then, 13 Papa Hotel, turn left heading 080 degrees. 080 degrees, 13 Papa Hotel. Alright, squawk is set, so right hand turn, VFR, we're going by the Wiley Bridge entry into our mantra so I'm just going to point that on the map. Delta Whiskey, amended departure instructions when you're ready. Go ahead, never mind, we're good on. November 930 Delta Whiskey after departure runway 03, right turn out on track to Detling, climb to maintain altitude 2400 feet. Okay, uh, on departure right turn to Detling. Alright, we're ready. And one, just 2400 feet, so November 930 Delta Whiskey ready. Mm -hmm. November 930 uh, Delta Whiskey correct. Confirm that you're ready. Thanks, Thanks for that. Thanks, Red 058, ready for takeoff. November 0 Delta Whiskey, runway 03, service wind 360, less than 5 knots, clear to take off. Let's take off runway 03, number 9, November. X-ray 558 by Alpha 1, runway 23, service wind 360, less than 5 knots, clear to take off. Clear for take off, thank you, set to 058. Right now, 13 Papa Hotel, 266, no, 30 miles, descent off, 4,000 feet, QNH1025. Edge one zero two five and apologies for repeating descent. Right now one three Papa Hotel. Oh, we well, got permission for takeoff, so you know. Descent four five and finish one zero two five one three Papa Hotel. Love control of good evening. The speed at eighty two Delta Mike at six thousand feet. Speed at eighty two Delta Mike, London. Five now flight level one three zero. Climb down, flight level 130, speed level 82, that's right. 84 Alpha Charlie, climb flight level 350. Climb flight level 350, 84 Alpha Charlie. 85 nothing further, Monotina Car 122, that's my eight, good night. nothing further, Monotina Car 122, that's my eight, good night. Hello, Unicorn 122, that's my eight, good night. Hello, Unicorn 122, that's my eight, good night. Alpha Charlie, nothing further, Unicom 122, that's the money, good night. 
Once you do that, mate, thanks for the great service in the G4. Charlie. You're welcome, thank you. Keep it 8, 2 Delta Mike, class flight level 360. Climb flight level 360, keep it 8, 2 Delta Mike. Right, M13, Papa Hotel, turn left, heading 075. Right, Papa Hotel, turn left, heading 075. Right, M13, Papa Hotel, no voice there, confirm left, heading 075. Left head in 075, right there, one free buffer, tell apologies. Thank you. Exit hotel 558, it'll be a basic service, I'm leaving control there. Yeah. Uh, basic service, thank you, exit hotel 558. Exit hotel 558, just confirm your requested reading. Uh, exit via the north, heading towards the Wiley... Uh, no, uh, can stay VFR, uh, heading north, and then uh, work way into the Wiley Bridge VRP for Manchester. Roger, so you're remaining clear of Stansted? Yes. Next to Hotel 558, Roger. Lovely, good evening, Ryan. 2404 with you descending 240. We're going out. Ryan 2504, London, Roger, score 03304. 0304, coming up 2404. You read your 77, nothing further, Monotina Com 122-18. Thank you very much, Richard. 7 upgrade. Yeah. Liam coming in with the 100 stars. Thank you very, very much. And Dan with the like. Really appreciate it. Cheers, Liam. Straight in the top, can tell. Uh, instant. I'm trying to keep my speed down here. We're hitting like 4500 to get well told off. I'm not careful. Right, so I'm keeping well out of the standstill traffic. Switch to Unicom, Air Force 127. Thank you. Good night. Right, uh, Rosie thank coming in with 100. Uh, with the 100. <laughs> with the like, thank you very much. I saw Liam's 100 there. <laughs> Bravo, Rosie, thank you so much for the like. And Dan with the share. Thank you very much. Delta Mike, nothing further in a car, 12 Delta Mike, good night. 1228 for us, Delta Mike, thank you very much for the see you, have a good night. Liam, coming in with another 100, what? Thank you very much, sir. You're a gentleman and a scholar. You're a gentleman and a scholar, thank you very much. Are we going to be heading smack bang over Colchester? Excuse me, one of my old haunts. We used to go up there and collect records. Nice, used, nine, three, used to go to the record shop up right there and uh, have a good old dig through. Used to love it. Rapture Records in Colchester is where I used to go. Used to used to be right opposite Wilkinson's on the hill as you go up from the train station. And uh, they moved to, to an alleyway between near where the cinema is on the main high street. And we are going straight over Colchester here. Where are we going to go? Oh, we're going to go straight over the Colchester Garrison. We're going to go over Castle Park as well, by the look of it. So this is Colchester Army Barracks, the Garrison. Pretty big. Pretty big. Then we've got Abbeyfield. We're going to head over the whole town, which is where we usually do the cosplay events and stuff. Over Culver Street and all that. And then we've got Lower Castle Park, or Castle Park and Lower Castle Park, where they do the events. Castle Park, Lower Castle. Right over by the hospital. Donna, thank you very much for the like. I used to come down here all the time on the train. Roller World as well. I used to go Roller World as a kid. We're going to start heading a little bit more into... Fuck! 
Isle of Wight. Donna is in on the act now, coming in with the free. 4,700. Thank you very Top much, sir. Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> there you go. Thank you very much, John. I want to say a special thanks to everyone that helped, like who donated on the previous Star Goal for the deposit for the for the bike. You know, it was a massive help, and I know Donna and Liam and Whip and Dan have massively helped with that. So really appreciated. Thank you very, very much, to everyone who helped. I'm getting really, really close to being able to pay the rest of it off as well without having to borrow any as well. So thank you again. It's a, it's crazy help. Still selling everything up I own like mad. So we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, Alright, we're heading north. Uh, we're going to go between Cambridge and Norwich. We're going to head out and then come across. Runway one three top hotel. Apologies, we'll be on the uh, we'll be establishing the LS now. We're just quickly making the final left turn. Runway one three top hotel. Roger, no need to report established. Runway two six left seven two three three. Hi ya, Donald. Hi ya. Two six left, good land. One one three top hotel. I was chatting to um, JJ earlier and. Uh Obviously, if it's okay with yourself in the future, perhaps next year, uh, depending on what. Next hotel five five eight will re uh, change frequency now. Do I change to London or to Unicom? Thank you. Next hotel five five eight. You're outside of control there, space. So if you would like to remain with air traffic, then that's fine. Alternatively, you can go to Unicom. Just advise what you would prefer. Uh, okay, if you're okay to stay with air traffic, next hotel five five eight. Hotel 558, five, five, if I remain with me, then it's a basic service, I'll coordinate with the next actor. Ah, appreciate it, thank you, it's Hotel 558. Five, um, so yeah, um, obviously okay with yourself. I've said that if there's any like south events or whatever, like, and I'm hurtling through, obviously not hurtling through, but you know what I mean, if I'm going through, um, pick him up on the way and we'll go. He can be my assistant. If <laughs> when I go live, like, do live streams and stuff and... You can come to the Thank events and stuff. You can contact London on 127.1. Bye bye. Contact London uh, 127.1. Thank you very much for your service. It's until 5 for it. Three Fox Hotel, we are the Birmingham Fox Trust, QNH 123. Three Fox Hotel, thank you, expect to have S33. Expect to have the LS33. Three Fox Hotel, correct. Uh, you can redirect to Chase and uh, high speed approved. Expect to have 5 speed, uh, Ryan, I'll take off the next one. Expect to have 5 speed, Ryan, I'll take off the Next hotel, 558 uh, London with you at 1,300 feet, on, uh, just heading over towards uh, Berriset Evans en route to Manchester via the Wiley Bridge BRP. Extra hotel, 558 London, good evening, thank you, base service, and uh, the uh, Chatham QNH 1024. 1024, thank you, um, basic service and uh, aircraft type is a tornado, extra hotel, 558. Very nice. Um, oh, we are away from a lot of air traffic, so it's 
tempted. We're gonna go. Go in a little bit. Cruise over this way, but this is Bury St. Edmunds. We're gonna head towards uh, RAF Lake and Heath. Uh, on this flight, well, actually, yeah, between Milden Hall and Lake and Heath. Expo 529, descend flight level 160. 160 uh, for Expo 529. Alan, good day, Kalan 787, passing central 32055. Very good timing, Kalan 787, London, good evening, Squawk 7342. Squawk 7342, Kalan 787. Shuttle 6 Hotel, redirect to Trent, Tango, November Tango. Direct to Tango, November Tango, thank you, uh, Shuttle Susan. Screenshots. Minor three four hotel, flying one four five. One four five, minor three four hotel. Need that nose trim down a bit still. <laughs> London, good evening, Ryan Air 2504 with you. We're descending for 160 level at that one. Ryan Air 2504, London Control, good evening. Expect vectors ILS 22. Expect vectors for ILS 22, Ryan Air 2504. Nice little run brother, here over Aria for Lake and Heath. Continue to install the fleet on Genesis 1 0 2 5. I'll find you for my phone. And X375, Victor. Tide part ways, I'm afraid. Unicorn, 1 2 2, that's my phone. 1 2 2, that's my phone. Thanks for your help as always. You're a diamond, X375, Victor. See ya. See ya. Expo 529, descend flight level 130. 130, Expo 529. Sorry, 18 Hotel, Ladder Control, good evening. Climb now, flight level 140. 140, sorry, 18 Hotel. Slightly in. And slightly inbound now, and I'll just move my mark for the Wiley Bridge, which was unclever, was it? There it is. Uh, gonna head in towards at Whist Beach. Balding. Balding like balding. I mean all over this beautiful countryside. Look at it. Lovely. We've still got Scotty with us, not sure who else is still here. Who else is here? Let me know in the chat. Are you still there, Gary? Or? Bravo, turn left heading 360 degrees, report localizer established, 33. Looks proper mean, just like cruising along, doesn't it? There is. Unicorn 122, that's great, thanks, and goodbye, shuttle 122 Tango. So yeah, tomorrow we're going to be doing a bit of construction sim, I think. It's, uh, it should be released tomorrow morning. Hope, and I'll try and get on and install it in the morning and see what the deal is. I do have to be out quite early. Um, I've got to take little man to um, nursery and then I'm heading into town. Going to be a bit of a bus wanker. Heading into town and uh, get, me, get me eyes tested. It's 17 hours now from release. Yeah, apparently Daniel was looking and in the um, Discord, the developers are hoping um, the keys will be released at 8 o'clock in the morning. 
So steam release at eight keys at eight as well. So all fingers crossed. Gary, evening room, Taurus. How you doing, Gary? Hope you're well. So fingers crossed we'll all be on that tomorrow. Alpha 84, my brother, it's Tennessee, 2000 feet, clear to RLS, 3-3. Christine says Echo 17 hours. Level 9 is 0. Flight of the 9 is 0. Excellent flight, you know. Alright, I get what you mean now. That's going to be 3 o'clock in the afternoon, isn't it? No, 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Hotel, Rudra at Brain. Good Brain, uh, sorry, one eight hotel. Alpine 8 for my brother, 333. Yeah, 8, eight, 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 eight a.m. in the morning, it's not 17 hours. 8529, Stay for the 7th We'll see you tomorrow, hour. definitely. Good to see you, too. Do you not want to give me a vector for TTRI? I'll say me, but I'm just a bit too hard for me. Not very good at Manchester. Oh, bless you. Once you see this, I'll make sure the rest of them get in. You should always give yourself a direct time off, why not? Um, yeah, sure, the mind. Fine, <laughs> 8250, further descent, short end, just got traffic passing below. No problem, uh, still with it, 2004. Yeah, there you go, look. 4,000 feet, Q and H, 1025. Approximately 17 hours. So that'll be 4 o'clock in the afternoon, Odd. We will see. Hopefully it's early. Get that installed and sorted. And uh, just confirm again the direct for Kilo 784. Kilo 784, redirect to Dickass. We'll see you tomorrow. Pity you direct didn't have Airwolf. Uh, no, what do you mean, Gary? I'll be looking at 8 a.m. Yeah, so will I, but yeah. We'll see. Won't be the first time a game's been unlocked in the afternoon. What was the last one I I was waiting for? And that was eight o'clock. Oh, that was um, in the afternoon. I can't remember. If there was one I was waiting for. Cold War was it? Cold? Nah, there was something after Cold War. It was on Steam. I honestly can't remember what it was there. Sorry, level I remember when it was streaming in the day and it didn't unlock until like four, 3 4 o'clock in the afternoon. It was really annoying that. Right, so we'll left heading 140 degrees. Beautiful weather. Right, so on track for the Wiley Bridge for LP to enter the Manchester airspace. What we're at, 700 feet. There is no air traffic around us right now. Uh, there's a few ahead of me. Time run a three fox right there. Come left now heading one three zero degrees. One three zero, right now three fox top. people around and see some green lights. Right now, 
three four zero delta and left heading zero seven zero degrees. Zero seven zero why not three four zero delta. Why not five zero four? Continue on your present heading, venturing on S T T. Continue on present heading, expect uh, IMS Q2 for Ryanair 2504. Yeah, going over newer Contrent. We're going over Clay Cross Chesterfield Bakewell. I'm just trying to keep an eye on the direction I'm heading. We're pretty much. I'm going to end up following the A17, which changes into the A617. One, two, three, four, short tail, sorry, two, 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 down, please. Two thousand, two hundred, three, four, four. Shuttle 6 Hotel, Monitor Unicom, 122 decibel 8, good night. Good night. 122 decibel 8, good night. 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 I can't wait till I can turn game tags on enough easy next, uh, t well, hopefully Thursday. Fingers crossed, Thursday. A lot of these planes will not work once the update drops, and I will have to spend some time fixing them. I'll probably do, like, one plane a night or something. But I'm not doing too many at once. Just do, like, one or two. One or two, or maybe three or four a week or something like that. Slowly get them back to working. The Vulcan works. The Vulcan does work, providing they've not changed anything else in their hot hot fixes but the Vulcan is up and working so we'll see quite a nice aircraft just cruising this isn't it just proper stable just goes so it's trimmed out nicely. It's not bad at all. Okay. Nicely done. Turn right heading 110 degrees. Turn right 110 degrees, 2504. Ryanair 3 Foxtrot Hotel, runway 33, clear to land, surface wind calm. Runway 33, clear to land, Ryanair 3 Foxtrot Hotel. That's me, nice. Ryanair 2504, descent altitude 4,000 feet. Ten four thousand run at two five zero four. Right two five zero four, continue right turn, please heading one two zero degrees. Um one two zero degrees to the right, two five zero four. I never quite realised why this viewpoint went like this when you're in drone mode, but it allows you to because here I can't control the aircraft, I'm controlling the camera. But then if I go into this mode, I can then control the aircraft quickly and then go back to drone. So I kind of figured out what was what was going on with this view mode. Did you ever try out the other hawk from the marketplace? I've got no Billy, no. I'm not paying I'm not paying for some piece of rubbish on the marketplace. <laughs> no Billy, I haven't tried it. Uh, DCK, hello, how are you? Hmm. 
not sure where Scotty flew off to. Trying to figure out if it's worth the money, apparently not. I wouldn't have thought so. Mr. Gibb with the followage and supportage. Two five zero four, right turn heading one eight zero degrees. Okay, Dallas two two. Right. Oh, wow, there's suddenly like loads of aircraft descending down on Manchester. Zero, what the hell? What the hell are they doing? Wow. We're going to be landing real soon. We met with some hills and stuff and then fly in and round. Let's have a little blip on the throttle, shall we? And one at 2504, we fully established uh, ILS 22. One at 2504, thank no. you, runway 22, clear to land when calm. Uh, clear to land, uh, runway 22, runway 2504. Get to them fully. I won't be able to see the chat while I've got me uh, thing going. There we go. Uh, hey, yeah, I'm doing seven days followage and 22 months supportage, man. Appreciate it. Oh, we are getting, getting close to the VRP now. Thank you. Good night. There's a ground, so we're going to get control all the way into the ground and we switched over when we land. That's not too bad. Billy coming in with a like, thank you very much. For some reason, I've, that's only just appeared there, thank you. But yeah, I, I honestly don't know Billy, so about that hawk, I can't imagine it's going to be great. Are you on Xbox or PC, Billy? Are you on PC or uh, Xbox, Gavin? X-ray Hotel 558, Barnsley Regional Pressure 1024. 1024, thank you, X-ray Hotel 558. They're all one through two four. Shit, makes it so easy, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> PC. Ah, nice. Have you ever thought about being on vaccine or anything like that, Kevin? Or giving it a try? Monica, you come one, two, two, decimal eight. Good night. 
Too professional for you. <laughs> you'll be to well, you've seen me, surely I'm no pro whatsoever. Welcome to Stanford. Taxi left on Hotel Charlie, stand 42 right. I'm going to go left onto Hotel Charlie and 42 right, 2504. Right, we're just heading over the Peak District Have National Park and then we'll be in on the Wiley Bridge entry. Service 2504. Oh, yeah. What's that to the station? Just stand by bedside. You're still with me? Monitor you to come once you do this late. Have a nice evening. Bye bye. Is he shown down? I need to learn to fly first, ooh. Did he say shine? Oh, he did as well. Man, I'm just about to get to Manchester. Alright, we are on Unicom. Need to learn to fly first. You look like you're uh, flying good enough, man. The secret is to learn VFR. And then the IF, the, then the ILS and all that lot and all the big stuff can come later. VFR is quite, I say simple, it's kind of simple. I, I obviously do it in the most sort of simplistic-ish way. It's all about intentions and, and the control and knowing what you're doing and where you are and stuff. As long as they can see that you're trying, they're usually not too like, anal about the particulars and stuff. As long as you can, you know, you let them know you the information and things. Right, so we're going in for the Wiley Bridge VRP. Let's see if there's any other air traffic around. At the moment it looks like it's just me. It's four down with one departure with no flight plan. So it should be pretty clear. There is a ground here. So what have we got? Uh, I've just looked at the ATIS information echo. Runway in use is 23 right. QNH 1025. So just beyond this hill is the Wiley Bridge VRP, so we're entering Manchester Airspace. I wing it. <laughs> Same as, man. This is the Wiley Bridge VRP. I'm going to take a right here. So we want 23 right. scout for traffic because we're like almost ready to land here. 
café. X-Ray Hotel 558 Tornado on base for runway 23 right Manchester. We're now cruising full flat. At 100, just 136 here with cruising. Nose right up. Gonna get ready for a nice left hand turn in onto the runway. Easy as pie. That is an awesome view. Manchester traffic extra right till 508 on finals for runway 23 right. CTD, ah, no way, man. Landing, thank you, thank you. I've exited a little bit early here. I think I'm up to up one. I am as well. Um, X-ray to till five five eight clear of Manchester runway two three right. Oh, oh, X-ray till five five eight to Manchester ground currently holding at up one stopped a little bit early there. <laughs> X-ray till five five eight. Uh, welcome to Manchester. Are you aware of the general aviation aprons? Uh, uh, are they to uh, sort of in front and left? I expect to five of it. Uh, they go by the name Tatom and Rumpa. Uh, I can see two light aircraft aprons. I expect to five of eight to the left. Uh, uh, kilo and then left 
or Kieler, Kieler Bravo then left onto whichever one that is, just as light aircraft for me, I'm afraid, XR 0558. XR 0558, uh, perfect, that's the uh, Tafamate from Zio, Kilo uh, Bravo, and then onto the uh, Kilo Bravo, thank you, XR 0558. Mine would have been the same if I didn't CTD, oh, I can dream. <laughs> I'm sure it would, I'm sure it would. See, there's two light aircraft here. There's one right in front of us, which is buried off for me here. And then this little one here, light aircraft. CTD while taxiing, wow. CTD heaven tonight. Unfortunately, I can't show you. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that is a shame. That is a shame. Alright, so we are here. Uh, Margaret, thank you so much for the like. Really appreciate it. Um... Xrail 558 uh, shutting down. Uh, just to confirm, which uh, apron was this, sorry? Uh, that's the Tatum apron. Tango, Alpha, Tango, Oscar, November. Tatum, yeah, Xrail 558. Hey, sir. Awesome, just for future reference. Thank you very much. Really appreciate your service. Xrail 558. Thanks for flying in. Uh, Francisco, what kind of jet is this? This is a Panav Panavia. It's a tornado. It's made by Panavia. Uh, it's a tornado F3. I need to fix it up a little bit. Sort out the wheel heights, contact points. Lower them down a bit. Sort out the pilot who seems to be always sick. So yeah, apart from that though. So yeah, I'm going to uh, I'll leave that here. I've done a couple of hours. Really appreciate it. It was good to see Goodwood. Goodwood, I actually really, really like that. So I probably will take a Cessna out of there at some other point. One of the Goodwood Cessnas. Really enjoyed that. Um, nice to be on Patsim as well. Have a little cruise. Uh, touch and go at Lid. And then on to uh, South End. And then uh, we've Patsim to Manchester. Uh, oh, really, really nice jet. My favourite is the F-18. Nice. Yeah, the F-18 is good. Uh, but yeah, um, Gavin, if you, if you ever want any help or just like, I don't know, lights in Discord or something like that, I don't, I don't mind, you know, if anyone... Official stations, not just the ground, will be closing in 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. uh, if anyone wants, like, help or, I don't know, just to fly around and just whatever, just let me know or... I honestly don't mind. I'm no pro, but... Flying some of the weird and wonderful aircraft that I have that fly really badly. It's made flying anything that flies well super easy. So, have you got the F-18? Uh, I believe I do, yes. I believe I do. Whether I've got it installed is another question right now. Because I've got an add-on linker so I can chop and change what's in my folder. So, uh, Nice to find Dave, thank you. I don't get a huge amount of time with three kids, so do it when I can. Yeah, I appreciate it, Gavin. I really do. It's awesome to have you with me. And again... I don't know if you know you've got some time coming up uh, just send me a message in discord and I'm sure I can make some free time and we can have a fly and a, even if it's just a chat or whatever or just talk about aircraft on here or airports or whatever man if you're on PC it's easy to help man so it's appreciated take care everyone uh, thank you to everyone that sent stars thank you to everyone that's sort of, uh, liked shared and followed really appreciate it take care and I shall be on tomorrow with some construction sim multiplayer all being well Oh yeah, take care, and I shall see you all tomorrow. I'll be in Discord for a little bit, but I'm going to try and get another early, early-ish night. Getting my eyes tested tomorrow, so I don't want to be in there tired with like tired eyes. I might be, I might pay the extra and have the health thing done as well. That's, I'm hoping they don't declare me blind or something stupid. <laughs> nice to fly, Dave. It's really nice to fly. See you later, friends. Cisco. See you later, Gavin. See you later, everyone. See you later, Scotty. Thanks for flying. And AB flew as well. 
Take care, everyone. And I shall see you all tomorrow.